The director of Thor Love and Thunder, Taika Waititi, recently sat down with EW to talk about the big unexpected role for Russell Crowe, who of course is set to play Zeus. It's unexpected because he's dying, right? Right? So from the moment that we found out that Russell Crowe would be playing Zeus in a film with Gore the God Butcher, it was a foregone conclusion by pretty much every single person out there and every single scooper out there said, oh, it's because Gore is going to kill him. And, you know, in a film where you need a character to kill a bunch of gods, you cast a god, yeah, that kind of spells disaster for him at sacrifice. So speaking with EW, Taika Waititi was asked about this, and he says that this is a type of Russell Crowe that you've never seen before, and that his role in this is really something that's unexpected that he hopes that fans are going to enjoy. And he also said that the way his story unfolds and the way he's connected to the story is interesting because of the push that they do in terms of the storytelling that relates to Thor. And he says that they needed to do something a little bit more interesting with the character of Thor that brings him in line with all of these different characters that we have in the comics that are joining the film. Again, Gore the God Butcher, Mighty Thor. We got Zeus, and who knows who else could be in this. There's plenty of rumors of Hercules, the son of Zeus, there's rumors about Beta Ray Bill. Again, that would also make sense. And since it looks like we might have some sort of tournament again, because of the whole Zeus holding some sort of intergalactic gladiatorial arena, that might make sense. But I do like that Taika is saying, look, whatever you expect from this, you're not expecting the correct thing. And it's going to be an unexpected role. I just hope that they can really do something unique with Zeus, because... A lot of things I've seen with Zeus, they kind of just play him up as this great figure. It's like, oh, he's so great. Look at all the great children he has. It's like, can we talk about how he got those children? Especially those uh, human ones? Mm-hmm. Yes, yes, that's uncomfortable. Like, maybe Taika is the madman who's going to go into that and finally do it and be like, yeah, so what of it? That'd be kind of cool. And also talk about how Zeus is a scumbag. You know, um just kind of lets his children go out there, and he's like, ah, I guess one of them died. It's okay, though. It's cool. I'm still Zeus, though. I got Herc over here. He doesn't really talk to me. Like, I want to see more of that. I'm hoping for that, but who knows? What are your guys' expectations? <laughs>